The hospital's history and timeline. Our medical institution was founded in 1999 under the name of Philip II. As an official opening date, we are celebrating the 1st of March 2000 when the first cardiopulmonary bypass surgery was performed by its founder, Dr. Zan Matrev. In 2002, Dr. Zan Matrev performed the first open heart surgery on a fully awake patient at this facility. The treatment of congenital heart defects began in 2003, with the first ACH occluder successfully implanted in a four-year-old boy with an atrial defect. A constantly increasing number of patients lead to the conceptualization of a sophisticated diagnostic center. This became a reality in 2008 with the opening of a 24-7 diagnostic center that instantly transformed our institution into one of the region's most prosperous healthcare center. Our 10th anniversary was celebrated in 2010, having completed 10,000 surgeries. The most relevant indicator of our hospital success is the constantly low mortality rate of roughly 1.5%. The scientific accomplishments brought many distinguished awards and acknowledgments both to its founder and to the medical team. Among the awards received, the most prestigious is the one obtained by the European Business Assembly and the Socrates Committee titled Best Healthcare Manager and Best Hospital. In 2002 Dr. Zan Matrev was promoted as an academician of Plato. The demand for the health services provided by our institution was constantly growing throughout the years. To satisfy the increased demand, we decided to build a new bigger and more sophisticated facility. The official opening of the new hospital named Zan Matrev Clinic was held in March 2016. This hospital is a modern, highly organized, and technologically advanced healthcare institution, for which we've received the prestigious Golden Seal by Joint Commission International in October 2017. In 2018 the hospital also received the National Accreditation for Quality, awarded by the National Agency for Quality and Accreditation of Healthcare Institutions. In March 2020 we have celebrated our 20th anniversary with 25,000 surgeries and more than 350,000 patients treated. The latest recognition came just a few weeks ago, from the city of Skopje, three members of our team, Dr. Tanya Angjaseva, Dr. Nikola Rostov, and Dr. Zan Matrev, were awarded with, the 13th of November prize, for special accomplishments in the field of medicine for successfully performing hearth transplantation, the first one in the country. The hospital has signed agreements with numerous domestic and international insurance companies which allows patients continuous health care. The mission. Our mission is to provide high-end medical services and results based on fast and precise diagnostics. We are aiming to help the prevention of diseases and to excel in performing complex surgical procedures. We are always diligently focused on increasing the patient's satisfaction level by offering a wide variety of services. Our primary goal is to help in preventing 21st century diseases. Efficiency and constant availability of services, combined with fast and accurate diagnostics 24 hours per day, 7 days a week, is our motto we always strive for. Dr. Zan Matrev's team consists of highly educated, fully integrated, and well-trained professionals, who respect our ethical codex and always work relentlessly to solve complicated medical dilemmas. Our vision. We continuously strive to maintain our primacy amongst the leading providers of private healthcare services in Southeastern Europe. We consider our institution to be a pivotal component of the healthcare system in Macedonia, setting the standards high for the others to follow. Professionalism and standardization are the values strongly rooted and highly esteemed in our company culture and this keeps our company a regional leader. Our vision. We continuously strive to maintain our primacy amongst the leading providers of private healthcare services in Southeastern Europe. We consider our institution to be a pivotal component of the healthcare system in Macedonia, setting the standards high for the others to follow. Professionalism and standardization are the values strongly rooted and highly esteemed in our company culture and this keeps our company a regional leader. The organizational chart. 
The organizational assembly at Zan Matrev Clinic is as follows. The highest level of management are the director and the organization and operation management body. The first level of governance consists of chief medical officer, chief nursing officer, head of finance and accounting, head of legal affairs and HR, head of quality management, head of administration. The building and surfaces. Created to satisfy the highest international engineering standards, the hospital is situated on an area of 9,000 square meters, with an effectively usable surface of 17,000 square meters. It is an eco-friendly building, with minimal carbon dioxide emission labeled also as a green building, due to its low consumption of natural resources, and low emission of dangerous gases. The systems that have been built within the hospital are guaranteeing high energy efficiency especially in the heating, air conditioning, and ventilation of the entire facility. Due to its design, this hospital has a low carbon dioxide footprint and guarantees maximum safety and functionality. The lightning and the coloring patterns in the building are our signature trademark. The primary purpose of the lighting is to ensure proper psychological and physical comfort to the patients by providing a peaceful and tranquil ambient using chromotherapy. The contrast in colors is unique as it stimulates interpersonal interaction. Overall, the objective is to provide the patients with an unhospital-like feeling, making their stay here more comfortable and pleasant. The Diagnostics Unit The unit is situated on the ground floor of our facility. Every ambulance is equipped with smart 3D ultrasound technology. The X-ray and radiology unit is fully equipped with the latest models in imaging, including X-ray, CT scanner, angiography, MRI diagnostics, and 3D tomography. All of them are the latest class of smart generation equipment with minimal radiation inflicted on the patient and employees during imaging, and maximal accuracy and interpretation in the shortest time frame possible. The entire unit is lead-coated and protected. Operating Theaters There are five modular operating theaters each encompassing a territory of 50 square meters. The operating theaters are equipped with the highest technological standards. Each one is equipped with Dreger machinery and lighting, Trump surgical chairs, surgical lights, and a compact monitoring system that visualizes the patient's current status. We have also four Soren machines for extracorporeal circulation. For anesthesia induction, four pre-theater units are used. They are fully equipped with anesthesiology monitoring machines. The latest generation of equipment offers long-term benefits both for our facility and enhances overall patient care and safety. Other hospital departments. The hospital has several departments specially designed to provide additional services for the highest patient satisfaction. Physical rehabilitation provides fast recovery, psychological support plays a crucial role in the patient's state of mind while awaiting surgery, our sophisticated kitchen provides healthy, safe, and tasty food for hundreds of patients and our staff, applying the highest standards of hygiene and care. The hospital's auditorium can house approximately 100 guests and is used for scientific and medical events. Capacity. Our hospital has 128 beds in total, which are divided into several departments. Intensive Care Unit. This unit is situated on the second floor and has a total of 40 intensive care beds divided into six different rooms, with six beds each, plus two additional double-bedded isolated rooms. This unit treats the critically ill and most vulnerable patients, both adults and pediatric. The optimal number of beds ensures that each patient is properly monitored and very closely followed. Semi-intensive care. This department is on the first floor, and there is no difference in the equipment used here, compared with the intensive care unit. This gives us the possibility to fast transform this unit into ICU if needed. 
In this department, there are nine rooms in total, with beds ranging from two to six depending on the room, with a total number of 32 beds. General Ward. This department is situated on the first floor and consists of 16 double rooms. Luxury Apartments. Despite the high standard of treatment that patients in each unit receive, there is also an additional option to be housed in a special unit with even more enhanced and patient-oriented treatment. These patients receive VIP treatment, with a nurse constantly available upon their request, along with additional services to maximize their comfort. 10 two-bedded apartments plus two deluxe apartments are available in this department. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, and the increased number of patients, our hospital needed to act fast and adjust to the new reality. We reorganized our capacities and increased the number of beds in the hospital by 23 additional ones. The total number of beds has risen to 151 beds. Our team. The number of professionals in our team is constantly growing following the needs and requirements of the hospital. We are placing a large emphasis on continuous education and progress in all our departments that results in greater employee satisfaction. The current number of employees is 296. There are 49 physicians employed. They range from cardiovascular surgery specialists, cardiologists, intensive care physicians, anesthesiologists, orthopedic physicians, urologists, internal medicine doctors, neurologists, transfusion medicine doctors, microbiologists, biochemists, pediatricians, all the way down to general physicians. 96 of the employees have graduated with basic high school nursing degrees, including 10 graduate nurses who have completed university-level nursing education. 58 professionals are accompanying medical staff, including physiotherapists, x-ray technicians, laboratory technicians, molecular biologists, and assistant nurses. 37 employees are in the administration department, marketing, PR and sales, finance and accounting, legal affairs and HR, info and call center, hospital administrators, 11 pharmacists and pharmaceutical technicians, and 45 people are employed as additional personnel. This includes security, technical support, hygiene, laundry, drivers, etc. The hospital has several contracted physicians, Dr. Nikola Georgov, Dr. Ristian Pisevsky, Dr. Liljana Simonovska, Dr. Liljana Ilyevska, Dr. Ninislav Ivanovsky, Dr. Boryanka Georgieva. Top 5 Procedures and Diagnoses in our clinic. The five most frequent procedures are induced by the following diagnoses, stenosis of the aortic valve followed by reconstruction, replacement of the aortic valve. Angina pectoris followed by a coronary artery bypass graft. Occlusion of the carotid arteries followed by reconstruction of carotid arteries. Occlusion of peripheral arteries followed by reconstruction, replacement of peripheral arteries. Thoracic aortic dissection followed by reconstruction, replacement of thoracic aorta. Statistics. According to the hospital statistics, the average perioperative stay at our institution ranges from 2.8 to 7 days. Depending on the type of surgery the statistics are as follows, cardiac surgery 7 days. Vascular surgery, carotid and peripheral arteries 2 days. Vascular surgery, abdominal aortic aneurysm 4.9 days. Orthopedic surgery 2.8 days. Abdominal surgery 3.2 days. Urology 4.7 days. Gynecology 3.8 days. We intend to lower the average hospital stay per patient, allowing faster transition back into their daily routines. We are noticing a decrease in hospital stay in 2020 compared to 2019. Number of hospital visits during 2020 in the past several years, the number of hospital visits is steadily increasing. The numbers are, diagnostics 45,352 visits, angiography 804 visits, 3,593 CTs, 687 MRIs, microbiology, 8,475 tests, laboratories, 15,801 tests, surgeries, 2,216. The total number of combined visits is 76,928.
Statistics for surgeries done in 2020, October included. We've witnessed 4,135 hospitalizations, of which 2,049 are surgeries. The number of surgeries by type, 923 vascular surgeries, 542 cardiac surgeries, 221 abdominal surgeries, 165 orthopedic surgeries, 60 urologic surgeries, 50 gynecologic surgeries, 23 pericardectomies, 65 miscellaneous thyroid surgery, chest wall surgeries, thoracic surgeries, mastectomies, amputations, etc. Anesthesia and sedation both in the OR and outside, in the diagnostic center and the intensive care unit, anesthesia and sedation are performed only by the anesthesiologists. Outsourced services. To ensure a continuously smooth workflow in the hospital, we use a variety of services offered by relevant and reliable third-party suppliers. Among them are, Fila Farm, is an affiliated pharmacy that helps us manage procurements, medical supplies, and also offers technical support for medical equipment. MedPoll's restaurant, is providing healthy and balanced meals for our patients and employees. Bioengineering, is our partner who helps to provide genetic and molecular personalized services for our patients. NetBit, it is our IT contractor that helps in everyday hospital software maintenance. Distant Point, is the IT contractor responsible for our hospital information system. BINORA, is a supplier that offers technical support for medical equipment. BIMAC, is a medical equipment supplier that offers technical support too. Drisla, is the national waste management company that helps us in the proper collecting and recycling of medical waste. Here is the list with the rest of our third-party contractors. Clinical Guidelines According to the National Law on Public Health and Safety in the Republic of North Macedonia, the medical practice should be based only on the principle of evidence-based medicine, following the guidelines designed and formulated by the Ministry of Health of the Republic of North Macedonia, fully aligned with the European and American guidelines. Our Chief Scientific Officer is responsible for updates and alignment with the changes in the domestic and international protocols on daily basis. Our medical staff is regularly informed and trained on how to implement all new guidelines. Here is the list of our guidelines. The Strategy of Zan Matrev Clinic. We have identified many challenges that we would like to cope with in the upcoming years. Our plan is to turn some of those challenges into opportunities and prioritize them. Strategic Priority 1. Deliver additional value for the patients. Strategic Priority 2. Enhance patient satisfaction through an environment that fosters employee dedication. Strategic Priority 3. Attain leadership in teaching, learning, and research. Strategic Priority 4. Provide clinical excellence through a multidisciplinary approach. Strategic Priority 5, Raise Social Responsibility Awareness Through Delivering Value for the Community. Our objectives for 2020 that are in line with our strategic plan included, JCI Reaccreditation. Compliance with IPSG. Implementation of Pediatric Cardio Surgery, Pre-Registration and Functioning as a Clinical Hospital. Development of One-Day Surgery, Treatment of Patients with Terminal Heart Failure. Quality Committee Structure and Governance. At Zan Matrev Clinic, patient safety and quality of the services are the guiding stars in our everyday work. We have established a quality committee, which focuses on ensuring maximum quality of patient care. This committee is led and managed by Dr. Dejana Popevsky, together with representatives of various departments. The main role of the Quality Committee is to support data collection, data analysis, and quality improvement for the identified priorities, hospital-wide, as well as a department and service specific. The Quality Committee plays a central role in coordinating the initiatives focused on improving quality and patient safety, ensuring a cost-effective process throughout the hospital, and providing guidance and direction for staff training. Employee communication plays an integral part in the development and improvement of patient quality and safety. 
For these reasons, the Quality Committee performs oversight of all other committees established in the hospital which includes, a Committee for Management and Control of Intra-Hospital Infections, an Ethical Committee, a Hospital Transfusion Medicine Committee, a Safety Committee, a Committee for Science and Education, a Pharmaceutical Committee. After 20 years of dedicated work, our team is still fervent and ready to overcome each and every challenge that we face. We live our lives in the fast lane in a constant race against time. Being healthy is the first step towards eternal happiness. Health preservation is every person's responsibility. But what about maintaining your health? Maintaining your health is our responsibility. Who are we? We are Jean Mitrev Clinic. We believe that the first step to a better health is a warm welcome and our duty is to help you feel at home and provide you with a high quality health care built on a 17,000 square meter area Jean Mitrev clinic is the first cardiovascular surgery hospital in Macedonia opened in 2000 where bypass surgery on an open heart was performed for the first time in country's history the hospital's state-of-the-art design functionality and technology makes Jean Mitrev clinic one of the most modern hospitals in Europe our patient care and our highly qualified staff make our hospital a standard in quality health care. Our modern medical equipment and our professional staff helps us provide accurate diagnostics with a great efficiency in identifying your health issues. Jean Mitrev Clinic has provided health care for over one million patients. Its success rate makes it one of the safest hospitals in the region and all of Europe. Since the very beginning, our mission is to provide security and comfort to our patients, along with exceptional health care and highly professional services. With over 30,000 performed surgeries, from which 20,000 are cardiovascular, our hospital is a benchmark of success. Jean Mitrev Clinic is the first hospital in the region that owns a laboratory of genetics and personalized medicine. We are always abreast of new medical technology and we constantly strive to better ourselves and our staff through continuous education. Our work is our passion and the only way to be successful is to do what you love most. That's our philosophy. Your trust is our driving force. It's our creed, our motive, our challenge. Health is the ultimate gift. And keeping your health is our duty and our great privilege.